about the sun is really doing its thing today hey guys what's going on it's your girl nissy t and you are back to another wake up wednesday it is another week another rooftop and yeah another wake up wednesday for you today if you have me on twitter or on instagram you would know that i try to film another wake up wednesday at home and once again the devil is a liar and um my sd card wasn't working um it told me that i needed to format it i tried to format it it refused to be formatted and then um i tried to find my other sd card because obviously i have some spares and i can't find the pack where i keep all of my sd cards and so i couldn't film a wake up wednesday using my dslr camera but i was definitely not gonna let that stop me i decided that i was gonna come to the rooftop of this building and i was gonna make sure i film another wake up wednesday for you wow it's actually kind of hot um i'm so sorry if my hair looks a little bit crazy just because the wind is blowing but i'm trying to still look cute for you guys with the sun in my eyes but hey what can you do anyway this week's wake up wednesday is actually quite simple sometimes you need to take a step back in order for you to move forward my hand is hurting so i'm moving on to the other hand but yeah if you have me on twitter you would know that i put up like a thread it wasn't a very long thread but it was basically a short thread um that was a conversation with myself and someone that i actually coach those that don't know i do one-to-one -one coaching sessions with different people different clients um i've been doing them for a hot second now i absolutely love and adore them i haven't really announced it to anyone like that just because certain things haven't been put in place before i could announce it but um the response that I got from that particular person was really really important um, in all of my coaching sessions basically I make sure that before we go anywhere before we move on before we move forward we look back first the only reason that I do that is because I know that a lot of things that affect us now are because of things that have happened in our past a lot of things that are stopping us from being who we need to be now are because of things that we haven't dealt with from our past so it's extremely 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 important that people deal with things that might have happened in their past that they you know maybe even felt like they had dealt with but hadn't properly dealt with just yet so during my coaching sessions we dig deep we make sure we dig deep like I make sure that with every single person I hear about their past history I hear about you know their family upbringing I hear about things that might have happened in the past why because it is so important those things that we might just try to dismiss those things that we might just think ah they don't really have much relevance now those are actually the things that tend to bother us the most because those things happened at such crucial times of our lives when we were still growing and developing and finding our sense of identity so yeah i had a coaching session with this particular person and there were things that they you know obviously shared with me which i obviously for confidential reasons can't share with you but they sent a really really beautiful response about how they finally had a conversation with their mother um and i'm trying to say it without kind of exposing too much but basically they finally had a conversation with their mother and they were just saying thank you for the advice that you gave me and thank you for your coaching abilities because I feel like it was it really really helped me to move forward that touched my heart I was so happy when I saw that honestly like I could have cried just because that is progress i know that by this person going back and just revisiting things from their past they are essentially helping themselves to propel forward so that's something that i just want to share with you today and it's even something that god has even really been working on my heart and has been telling me recently telling me about some things that i still have to go back things that i thought i had dealt with but things that even i still have to go back and dig deep and really deal with in order for me to properly move forward into the place of greatness that i know that he's called me to be in oh no people have come but anyway and so yeah just for me to kind of wrap up because i'm not even gonna take too much time i'm sat down i'm a bit tired now and my hands are getting tired but it's so so important that you make sure you take yourself back even if it's painful even if it's things that you have tried so hard to just forget and to pretend doesn't exist and hasn't happened and hasn't affected you it's so important to take a few steps just a few steps backwards in order for you to be propelled forward maybe there are things in your childhood and um, that you haven't dealt with maybe there are traumas maybe there are things that people have done to you people have stabbed you in the back people have done certain things to you um that you you know you you didn't even think about or didn't even think affected you but when you sit back and you really think about it you're like wow I think there are certain things that I need to deal with before I can move on to anything else or even sometimes to anyone else. Maybe it was a relationship, a toxic relationship that you thought you just forgot about, but actually you're realizing, nah, I'm still seeing how it's affected me today. So just to kind of wrap up today, I just want to ask you, what are you running from? What are you hiding from? What is it in your past that you are scared or you're worried about, you know, digging 
um, revisiting and redigging is so so important I'm only just I'm not shy because there's people here and I think they're having like meetings and stuff but it's so so important guys that you dig you dig even if you don't want to even if you you're scared to do so you dig go back into your past and figure those things out it's only when you do those things that oh my goodness you can truly build on a firm solid foundation where you know that all of those things can't come now one day and you know hit you one day and you just feel your foundation crumbling no but rather you've dealt with them you've dealt with what you needed to deal with and you can move forward and be the best version of yourself that you can be so yeah what are you gonna do today if there's something that you need to deal with it's time to take a step back my hair looks crazy my hair looks messy so i'm gonna start going now because this is just embarrassing what is this it's so sad like why is my hair I'm so, i don't know what's going on but just to but i'm gonna the wind is really not my friend today but yeah that's all i wanted to say anyway it's very very important that you take some time to revisit your past to truly deal with those things in order for you to progress in your present and to make sure your future is also as bright as you want it to be so i'm saying it for the very very last time sometimes you have to step back in order for you to propel forward maybe you haven't been getting to the places that you want to get to not even because of anything that you're doing but maybe just because you haven't dealt with some things that went wrong in the past so deal with those first and then see how you progress and how you do um but yeah thank you so much guys for watching don't forget to like subscribe and share all of that good stuff and if you are interested in some coaching sessions you can drop me an email i leave my email below that confidence coaching sessions one-to-one -one. so it's just me and yourself but also just make sure you're um you're staying up to date with everything happening on my twitter and my instagram because i'm going to be making an announcement at the end of this week that is in relation to the coaching sessions as well but anyway thank you so much for watching guys stay beautiful